In this video, I'll be showing you how to get mods for Gorilla Tag. Like that. Bruh. Now, before this video starts, I need to say two things. One, you need a certain computer. It doesn't matter what computer it is, it just needs to be good enough that it can actually run Gorilla Tag. In the description, I'll put a list of the specs of a computer that actually will run Gorilla Tag. And if you don't have them, then it probably won't work and it might break your computer. So if you don't have a good enough computer, just don't try installing mods. And second thing, basically only install mods from the Gorilla Tag botting Discord. Every mod has a chance to ban you, but ones from the Gorilla Tag Discord are a much less chance of get having you getting banned than ones outside the Gorilla Tag Discord. So just install mods from the Gorilla Tag modding Discord. Now without further ado, let's start with the video. So the first thing that you will need is you will need Gorilla Tag on your computer. And you might be thinking, oh, I have Gorilla Tag on my Oculus headset. That doesn't really count, and I'll explain. So basically, to mod Gorilla Tag, you need the PC version of the game. And there's two places you can get that. One is the Oculus PC app, and two is Steam. I don't have Steam, but I have the Oculus PC app. And on PC, on Steam and the Oculus PC app, Gorilla Tag is $20. And you might be wondering why, but it's because since you can only mod the game on PC, there's, there's modders. And if modders get banned for cheating, they have to pay another $20 for the game. And if you pay the $20, you get 5,000 shiny rocks when you start. So basically, if you're buying shiny rocks, it's basically just giving you it for free. And they added the $20 limit to kind of prevent cheaters, and it has kind of gone down, because no one wants to spend $20 over and over again. Once you have Gorilla Tag on either Steam or the Oculus PC app, go to Gorilla Tag's modding Discord. I'll probably post that in the description if I can. And you need to click on this link right here. And the command to get this is question mark MMM. And once you click on that link, you click this file, and then it will appear up here. And then you click on the file, it says open file, and it should say Gorilla Tag, like Monkey Mod Manager can't find Gorilla Tag, click OK. So click OK, and if you have Gorilla Tag installed, it will open your Gorilla Tag folder and click on Gorilla Tag.exe, like the one with the gorilla face, and then click OK. Once you do that, it will open this page right here. And what you first need to do first is if these two aren't installed, install them by clicking these things right here and click install slash update. And then once you do that, you also have to click this one, which will also enable this one too, and then click install slash update. To see your mods folder, which is where you put the mods so you can actually play with them, you click mods folder and it will open your mods folder. Once you download mods, I'll show an example right now. Basically where you find mods is in the PC mod releases section in the Grill Tag modding discord. And here you can just find a bunch of mods you want. You can also search up here for mods that you want. And just say I want to download this GoPro mod. I would click the download link that they say, not the source code because it says don't download. And sometimes it shows this. It's safe. And also, sometimes it opens a page like this. Like for this one, it just opened a page. And if it says this, just continue to download it. It is not a virus. It just says this because Discord usually has a lot of viruses going around. I almost guarantee you it's that it's safe, so just continue to download it. Once you download mods, if you do it correctly, it will be in a DLL file. And it will probably appear in your downloads. So you click on the DLL file and you drag it into plugins. I will put in the description where you get to your plugins folder so you can just do it easier. Like you can have this video open at the same time as you have the description open looking at where you put your mods. And once you have your mods installed, you just click Gorilla Tag on your headset and you have to plug like the link cable in and stuff. And then you should have modded lobbies under the game mode section and that's where you can use most mods is in the modded lobbies so yeah that's how you install mods 
If you have any questions, leave it in the comments and I'll answer it. And bye.